Greetings, Poke fans! Michael here, and welcome to the second episode of my Pokemon Sun Let's Play walkthrough, whatever thing. Uh, I did receive this product free, free from Nintendo. I do have to say that in every episode. Sorry. Um, but, anyways, in the last episode, we arrived at the Alola region, started the game, and I selected my starter, Sammy the Rowlet. He is adorable, and I love him. Look at him, he's so cute. Oh my god. Okay. Um, but now, I forgot what I'm supposed to do. Um, what do you... If you two can walk together, not many can go anywhere. Okay. Um, I feel like I'm forgetting somebody. Yeah. Oh, my mom! Okay, that's what... Right, I'm supposed to go talk to my mom. Forgot about that. How? Hey, you and me. Let's have a Pokemon battle. Okay. <laughs> Where's the fire, boy? What kind of a Pokemon battle would that be where you don't even give a name first, eh? You mean like most Pokemon battles in this universe? Fair enough. Then I'm How, and my partner's Poplio. Oh, he has the... The disadvantaged one. Your Rowlet looks really cool, too. What? You like Pokemon? Of course. Everyone likes Pokemon. Thanks? Yeah, so let's battle. I couldn't wait for you to find your way to Iki Town, so I've been looking so I've been all over looking for you. You've been stalking me? Like who are you? Um I don't really like to see Pokemon battles where Pokemon can get hurt, but I'll watch for you. Oh yeah, your first battle already! <laughs> Just have your Pokemon dish out some moves and see who wins. Whoa! I appreciate you being willing to take on my grandson. Oh. Okay, valuable knowledge. I expect a no holds barred battle from both of you. Alright, well, let's do this. You'll battle me, right? I know you will, right? Yeah, and I won't lose. All right, this is gonna be great. Very well then, let the Pokemon battle begin. Friendly battle music. Let's kick this guy's butt. I can't believe they like, really are making these games easier. Sammy! Fight, leafage. Nice. Pound! Okay. Fight Leafage once more. I like this music. It's very... Oh, we're speed tying. Interesting. Excellent! Good night! Oh, sweet! Lots of HP boost. Everything else stays the same. Hoo and he gives me a hundred bucks. Which, if you ever watch my video, do Pokemon dollars make sense? It's actually about one dollar. One US dollar. Michael, right? Your rally was awesome! Now that settles it. I'm going all out tomorrow. Huh? Hmm. Michael? Would you be so kind as to give me a look at that sparkling stone you have there? Oh, uh, yeah, sure, man. There you go. Could it be? Tutu, isn't that... You were rescued by Tapu Koko at the bridge. Isn't that what I heard, Michael? That's when I got that stone. So it even... Dain to give you a stone. Perhaps you are here in Alola, Michael, because this is where you are meant to be. Allow me to borrow this stone for now. Fret not, I will return it to you tomorrow evening. It would seem that you have the makings of a fine trainer. You must do us the honor of joining in our festival tomorrow. 
Hmm. Interesting. Am I gonna have to wait a day? First, I'll make sure you get back home safe today, though, Michael. Billy, you you should come with us too. Yeah. Wouldn't want to go losing you twice in one day. You were that precious Pokemon of yours. Yes, I I will keep an eye on. Oh, you, would you tr not try to escape the very moment that you were told not to wander off? <laughs> LOL, LOL. You almost lost the freaking thing. Oh, a garage. Do we have a car? We're back home. Welcome back, Michael. So, what kind of Pokemon did you get? I got the coolest freaking owl on the planet. Don't keep me waiting. Oh, he's so cute. Oh, I think I'm falling in love. So why did you choose this sweetheart? Because it's... I don't know. It's both. I'll say cool because Decidueye is super cool and that's the main reason I'm picking it. Well, then you picked right because I'd say this little charmer is definitely cute and cool. Mom knows me. The two of you look great together. I feel happier just looking at the pair of you. <laughs> this is awesome. I love this game. Was that the, the Pokedex? The next day. What a stunning sunset. All right, today is the day that I finally... <laughs> <laughs> She's not gonna unpack anything. Was that the doorbell? Go see who it is, Michael. Okay. Is there a way to get to the garage? It doesn't appear to be. Can I open the fridge? Oh, look at me. Washing my hands at the sink. Alright, let's go see who's here. Kakui just busting into our house again. Rings the doorbell, then just enters. <laughs> hey there, Michael. It's about time we set off for the festival, yeah? But first, now that you're a real Pokemon trainer with your own Pokemon and all, I've got to show you something. Come with me on to Route 1. Have fun at the festival, Sweeney. I'm sure you'll have a good time with your new Pokemon pal. Me and Meowth will be sure to unpack every last box here. You'll see. You're not going to. You're not going to, Mom. You're, you're not kidding anyone. Maybe yourself. Hmm. Michael, hurry it up, cousin! Pretend you're a Pokemon and use your agility! You and your move references, Kukui. You and your move references. Oh, one thing I want to try is, um, what do you call it? Pokemon Refresh. Give your Pokemon tender loving care. Pet them gently and make them very affectionate towards you. Gotta use the stylus. Poke beans. <laughs> They're beans. You can get them in the cafe in any Pokemon Center. Okay. Pokemon can get dirty when they battle. Oh, I like the Porygon hair dryer. Um, switch Pokemon you care for. Pokemon will come very effective. We'll battle with Zest. Make lots of Pokemon affectionate toward you. Okay. He's so cute. Oh. Okay, let's give you a bean. This is this is Pokemon to me, essentially. Where are the grooming tools? I may not have any yet. That is not what I wanted to do. Um, I guess I'll just feed him till he's full. I bet he's full now. Oh, never mind. Okay, that's probably the last one. I wonder what the different colors signify. <laughs> oh, that was cool. Alright, stylus back in the port. I don't think I have Rowlet in my Pokedex yet. Oh, this is awesome. This area is really cool. Route 1. 
Yeah, over here! When do I get Rotom in my Pokedex? So you know that wild Pokemon will sometimes jump out at you in the tall grass, yeah? Now that you got Rowlet there, you can not only fight wild Pokemon, yeah? You can also try to catch him! Whoa! I'm gonna show you how to catch a wild Pokemon, alright? Keep your eye on the prize! Eyes on the prize! Alrighty! Kakui and his rock rough. I just kinda have to sit here, don't I? Wow, that was convenient. Alright, I know that, Kukui. I'm a veteran! Why didn't he use the shortcut? The shortcut that I was pleasantly surprised to see during the demo. Okay, one. A two. A three. It's kinda like that, uh, what do you call it? Uh, Tootsie Roll Pop commercial. Mr. L, how many licks does it take to get to the center of a Tootsie Pop? Well, let's find out. A one, a two, a three. <laughs> Old commercial, but a good one. Well, Pokemon do sometimes attack people if they get close. But catch them and they'll join your team and be a great help to you. Yeah! But if your Pokemon get all tuckered out by fighting for you, just head home for a bit. If you ask your mom, I'll sure she'll let you and your whole team rest up at home. Or you could use some potions. Here's some Pokeballs and potions to get you started out. Thanks, Kikui. What a bro. Dun 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 dun! You open the items pocket and put the Pokeballs away inside. Hooray! The dun 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 dun, dun sound kind of reminds me of a uh, Colosseum and XD. Like, I feel like it sounds similar. Why don't you have a little adventure of your own on the way to Iki Town, eh? Take good care, Michael. Take good care of Michael, Rowlet. This is not the way we went originally, though. And this is happening. A pick a peck? Nah. I don't really want to catch it. Plus, it has the type advantage, so time to run. The game looks so cool, though. I love that I can just look over the sunset. Oh, hey, there's a little area. Oh, an item. Can I go behind the tree? No, I can't. A potion! Who's, who's that? A child. I must fight him. For glory! Cool. One thing I want to do first, though, is I, I'm just confused as to why I'm going this direction instead of the way that I went the first time. Wow, I can't believe I didn't get hit by a single Pokemon in there. How old the outskirts? Didn't I go th Oh, what the heck? Whoa! Enough already, Tortles. Come down, you're gonna hurt somebody! Okay, well, that... Alright, guess that explains why I can't go the other way. I love how much excellent stamina the Pokemon, the trainers in the Pokemon world have. Because, like, other games, like Skyrim, you can only run for a little bit, and then you get tired. But, like... What do you A ladybug. Interesting. I also don't have the type advantage, so... Time to run. Uh, but they, like... You can just run infinitely, which I really appreciate. Alright. Alright, let's battle this smug kid. You are, you are a small child. You are a very small child. Arr! He's very angry. Everybody's got a three and Oh, it's an Alolan Rattata! That's awesome. I love it. Oh, whoa! Nice critical hit. And of course he gets one too. Okay.
Wow, that looks like it almost didn't knock it out. That would have sucked. <laughs> 20 experience! I lost, but that was so exciting! Okay, you child. You look like you can't even read yet. And yet you somehow have a Pokemon. No NTN, though. That looks so cool! Where is that? Oh, wait! That kind of looks like the area from the demo. Well, actually, I'm not really sure. Oh, you're taller. You might be more formidable! I'll show you my sister who I'm super close to. Are you trying to pimp out your sister? Like, what are you saying? Audrey! It's a pleasant name. Caterpie! Caterpie! Yeah! It's so tiny. It's like I'm using tackle for this. I'm looking forward to when I learn a flying type move. I hope it's not very long. Aha! That did very little. Critical hit, so I don't have to use it again. Bummer. Cool animation, I like that. Wow, those are... Well, those orbs there, that was intense. Okay, what does this pressing this plus do? Okay. Okay. Oh! Oh, that's so cool! It gives you, like, how much it's lowered. It's got filled out the dots. That's so awesome, I love that. Overgrow. Okay. That's so cool. Wait, can I look at Caterpie? I can! It shows me the stat boosts there. Alright, I should just finish this off. Why are you making me so slow? You're only delaying your demise! There we go. The owl takes out the bug. If only I had, like, Peck or something. What is this? Does it allow me to go straight into it after a battle? Oh, he's covered in goop! Dusting off sand, wiping off dirt, grooming, healing status conditions, drying wet Pokemon. This may not appear to be the correct tool. Um, there we go. There we go. You're welcome. There's no way I'm going to end up doing that after every battle. <laughs> Alright, cool. Alright, let's get this item. Sparkly. A Pokeball! This is only like the third wild Pokemon I've encountered. Young Goose! Well, hello, Mr. President. I'll knock you out for some experience. Nice. I might need to use a potion relatively soon. Uh, yeah, after this battle. 40 PP, that is wonderful. Alright, Young Goose goes down. That's gonna give me, like, no experience points, is it? Oh, got me level 7! da 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 That's a very quick one. I like the sounds. I should have probably fine with it without using a potion for at least a little bit longer. An item? I must get to it. I like how the camera angle allowed me to see that. Gotta get an antidote. Festival in Eaton, gonna start anything? Sure, anything? Okay, so that's why they don't want me going that way. But where am I? This is not the way I know to go to Icky Town. Crap. Another young goose? Okay, no, I'm just gonna run. I should probably catch a Pokemon in case something goes bad and Rowlet faints. I want like a, a rock rough or like a grub in. Probably fight you. I appear to be close to the festival though, because there are like tiki torches and everything. What is this trainer class? A preschooler. They give a preschooler 
creatures. Because that's logical. I'm like, I should have gotten a Pokemon long before this guy ever did. Nice. Okay, don't do too much damage. Okay, we're fine. Excellent! Alright. I defeated the preschooler. He's so upset and frozen. Oh my gosh, when you defeat somebody, they become statues. I want to look at the options really quick. Options. Tech speed I want fast. Uh, so I'll switch. Button mode. Default. When you catch a Pokemon in your party's full, you can choose the destination you send a Pokemon to. Oh, really? I just registered what that means. That means that you can either catch... You can either choose, like, put this in my party or just send it straight to the box. That is so useful. Oh my goodness golly gee, that's awesome! This game is such a bro. And I know, I must get it. Alright, what's the Pokemon? I knew that was gonna- IS THAT A SHINY?! This is the second episode of my Let's Play, and I found a shiny! Oh my god. Oh my god. I cannot believe this. I cannot believe this. Holy crap. Oh my god. Oh, my heart is pounding. Okay, that's safe. I can't risk a critical hit. Oh my god, my heart is racing. I cannot believe this. I cannot believe this. Okay, one more tackle, and then I'm just gonna try with the Pokeballs. Oh my god. Oh, I didn't use the shortcut. That's fine now. Oh, I have ten, not five. I caught a shiny! <laughs> I caught a shiny Pokemon in the second episode of my Let's Play! Holy crap! Holy crap! Oh my god! Oh, and I learned Peck! Oh my god! I caught a shiny Young Goose! Oh my god! This is- this is the greatest thing to ever happen in my YouTube career! Oh my god! Yes, I want to give Young Goose a nickname. What are we gonna name you? Um... Holy crap. Holy crap. I have no idea what to nickname it. I'm gonna nickname it... Hero. Because this, this is just the hero. Oops. This is, this is a good omen, guys. This is a good omen. I cannot believe this. I cannot believe this. I caught a shot. I'm saving the game right now. He might have to be on my team now, yes. <laughs> I cannot believe that. That is... That is insane. I've probably... I probably clipped out the mic. Yes, I did. Sorry, guys. <laughs> I caught a shiny young goose. Oh man, I'm like, I'm a little bit lightheaded, guys. I am, I am 
Oh, I have to do the freaking drag thing. I don't like that. Do I have to hit Y? I have to hit Y and that. Okay, that's okay. That's admittedly annoying. Um, but oops, I pulled out my headphones by accident. Ugh. You guys still hear it, but I do not. I have like a headphone splitter. Half of it goes to the mic, and then half of it goes to me. Okay, there we go. I got my sounds back. I, that's, this is, I, I'm freaking out. <laughs> oh my god, that's, that's spectacular luck. That is spectacular luck. Oh my god. I have to use this young goose now. That's a level 5 Caterpie, dang. <laughs> I love Pokemon! <laughs> How is that a critical hit at the same day? Did I get two critical hits in a row? Oh, what is Young Goose's ability? What is Young Goose's ability? Summary. Stake out. I forgot what that does. Let me see. Doubles the damage dealt to the target's replacement if the target switches out. Okay, okay. It's not if it gets attacked first. I was mixing it up in my head. A paralyzed heal. I caught a shiny freaking young goose, guys. I, I realize you know that, and I've repeated that several times, but like... I'm, I'm freaking out. I, I'm, I'm gonna run for this because I'm ready to move on with the story, but holy, holy crap! <laughs> Alright, let's do this festival. That's gonna make a great thumbnail, I have to say. <laughs> Everybody's being so ch- it's like a block party. I want to show everybody my shiny young goose. Holla! Look at this thing I caught! <laughs> The Alola region is made up of four islands, and each island has its own guardian Pokemon. Our festival today is held to express our thanks to these great Pokemon guardian deities for always remaining by our sides. You said Tapu Koko was fickle. Well, we may call it a festival, but it's just this little thing you see here. There may not be many of us, but at least every last one of us here goes all out. Cool. Is he gonna wanna battle? I'm afraid he's gonna wanna battle again, so just in case. Rowlet probably doesn't need one. Man, I'm going through his potions fast. Hey, how? How you doing? <laughs> Man, I thought you'd never make it. Me and Pablo have been waiting for ages. I was I was catching a shiny young goose, how? A shiny young goose. Hold on, didn't anyone to explain to you about tonight? Oh yeah, right on time. But to what exactly? Yeah. A full-powered festival for Pokemon battling. We battle in the name of Tapu Koko, pitting our best moves against one another in friendly competition to please our guardian. Woo! So you two will be taking part in the battle? I don't like seeing Pokemon fight one another since they so often end up getting hurt. Well, they're actually referencing that. But it seems like this is an important event, so I'll be sure to watch you both. Your Pokemon have fought for you, so show them the same care in return, Michael. Allow me to heal them for you. Ah, oh, man, wasted the potion. Oh well. Not a big deal. Are you ready for this Pokemon battle? Yeah, let's do it. I want to show everybody my shiny freaking young goose. Probably could have stopped recording considering I'm at 30 minutes, but I don't care. For all life on our islands. And for those who undertake the island challenge with joy in their hearts. We pray for your protection. For them and all Mele Mele. May this Pokemon battle be an offering to our island's guardian deity, Tapu Koko. 
before you stands how grandson to the kakuna kaku <laughs> the kakuna the kahuna before him stands michael one who has met with tapu koko he carried me that was a bonding moment what what a curious little thing tapu koko is ha huh, that's just typical of it Young Goose, take care of my little Michael. As long as we both have a good time, then I think we can all call it a great battle, eh? Michael, how? Bring forth the power of your Pokemon. Alright, let's go. Let me show you how this Young Goose do. I just, I, I spit on my screen. I'm embarrassed. Okay, it's taken care of. Pichu! You should nickname it Machu, so it's Machu Pichu. <laughs> Level 6, I wouldn't- oh no. Well, that sucks. This is gonna take forever. Yeah, we get a critical hit. Maybe he'll switch out. I would love it if he switched out. That'd be so cool. Oh no! Well, this is gonna take a long time. Uh oh. Uh oh. That's not good. I might end up having to bring in Rally. <laughs> Why are you showing me the booty? Oh yes, the tackle happened. Curse you for lowering my freaking attack so much. I'm scared I'm gonna let Hero faint. Okay, I think I'll only like seven more. Okay. Okay, that's a special move, so it's not affected by my defense, although I totally have to use a potion. If I want Yungus to get all this experience. I have three left. Where are the Pokemon centers? Alright. Come on, finish it with this tackle. No! <laughs> Critical hit? Oh yes, it still did it! That's awesome! Alright, level 6. Alright, I'm gonna keep him in just for the sake of the experience. Alright. Then Pokemon, bring in Rowlet, switch. What is Howl's posture? It's... Okay, there he goes. That's that's something new. And that wasn't the camera angle I was expecting. Oh, nice. I like the camera angle, though. Leafage! I'm on this episode go along, <laughs> but that's okay. I'll deal with the care later. I defeated Pokemon Trainer How! With my shiny young goose! Hooey! Another great battle! Oh, is that the crowd? Here, the Tapu Koko liked it too. Phew, that was awesome, Michael! That was a really great battle. I had a blast fighting you! It was a good battle. With this, even Tapu Koko. Oh, hello? Oh, you heard it yourself. Tapu Koko's song of approval. Oh, I nearly forgot. I think it is time you take this, Michael. My Z ring. Sweet.
Your Z-Ring, a mysterious armband that can draw out the power that lies deep within Pokemon. It can bring forth their Z-Power. We Kahunas can make them by refining stones like the Sparkling Stone that you receive from Tapu Koko. Although until you collect more Z-Crystals during your Island Challenge, you will not be able to draw out the Z-Power of your Pokemon. And yet, you have already received that Sparkling Stone. It seems Tapu Koko took quite a liking to you, or perhaps it has a mission for you. In other words, it's time for you to get out there and start your Island Challenge! If you visit every island, maybe you'll figure out what that mission is. The Island Challenge? Four islands! <laughs> Sudden camera zoom! You'll travel to each of the four islands here in the Alola region. The Island Challenge is about aiming to be the strongest trainer. The Island Challenge Champion. Woo! Sounds great, right? I can't wait to have a real adventure! I'll explain about the Island Challenge later. And there are just so many freaking cutscenes in the beginning of this episode. In this, at the beginning of this series. Tapu Koko is amazing, isn't it? I hope I can meet it someday and thank it for saving Nebby. <laughs> Me too. It saved you as well, didn't it? And left you with that sparkling stone. Even though you're a stranger to this place. Suppose it's time we get your kids home, yeah? And I suppose it says goodbye. Okay, bye. Honey, I'm home! Oh, Michael, you're back already? I thought you want to stay in Iki Town longer. Especially right after that great battle. Oh, I was just captivated to see my own boy fighting in such perfect sync with his Pokemon. Maybe it would be a good idea for you to try that island challenge thing. It's something you can only do in Alola, right? But now I've got a date with my bed. <laughs> I danced my feet off at the festival. Night night, sweetie. You get some sleep too. Aw, good night, Jingles. The next day. Are you gonna let me finish the episode? No, no, we're not. What beautiful weather! I wonder what today will bring me. Oh, now it actually it's actually doing the correct time of day now because I'm recording this at night and I can tell that it's nighttime. Oh my god, stop right <laughs> A visitor! Let me guess, it's Kikui. He'll probably let himself in without even waiting. Yep, true. Alright guys, well before I find out who that visitor is, I'm going to call it an episode. I went long. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed seeing me freak out over that shiny young goose, because I freaked out. Holy crap. That's the most amazingly ridiculous thing to ever happen to me in a Pokemon game. So, thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please leave a like, answer the comment, question, and that is all I have for now. So until next time, Pokefans, gotta catch them all!